What is up, guys? Welcome back to the beta with West Ham. It is our first European night of Football Manager 2022. We played Jablonek. Things are going all right, but we... Uh, Moisey's embarrassing me, put it that way. But injury-wise, we are struggling, right? But I am putting this down with the fact that Leeds, in the first update, didn't have the injuries they should do. We have quite a few uh, fitness concerns of our own. So, let's get into it and just get to, get to how badly we're actually doing there. So, at first glance, 12th place isn't bad, right? We need to finish top R, which is obviously 10th and upwards. You know, could I, I'm doing all right. I mean, I haven't lost this this, this uh, Premier League month yet. And I won't now either, because we're playing the European Cup. So we're okay there. One result, 1-1 one, one here. Honestly, Mikel Antonio, right, is so good when he wants to be. But I don't even know this case. Joe Rodon, he's... He's a Welsh defender. He actually scored from open play as well. Or two goals. Joe Rodon, so apparently that doesn't even play for him in real life. But you know. Watch everyone come up the world with that. He's played loads of games, I'll have you know. You're wrong. But that is our only loss of the month. 3-0 against Tottenham isn't isn't too bad. I mean, Tottenham have got a good squad on here. FM DNA is going to be absolutely buzzing. But we take with that what we can. But since then, you know, a 3-2... Against Brentford, a 3-2 Palace, a 1-1 against Watford, we should have won. 92nd minute from Tom Cleverley. But what we need to talk about is the injury-wise. Fitness concerns with Suchek, who's obviously, he has to play today because we need to win this game. Fitness concerns with Mikel Antonio. Do you want to drop a uh, couple for Fredericks? Ben Rama's out. Creswell's out. Vlasic <laughs> has concerns. Not looking good. The youngsters are nowhere near good enough, by the way. He had one appearance, he was shocking, so that didn't go to plan. We've been toying with this kind of formation still. Obviously, on the clean slate, we set up the end of the last episode. When Antonio is not fit, it drops back into this, which to be funny, oh, we need to play that this week. Injuries are killing me, man. Injuries are killing me. We've been playing that with a shadow strike right attack, which is shocking, but there's not a lot I can do. I can't, I can't play either of these. I can't risk injuries. If we get any injuries here, we're in serious, serious trouble. Which is something you don't really want, isn't it? I need him more attacking, to be fair. Push him up. So, we're out of the Carabao Cup, which isn't the end of the world. We, fourth round, we're not going to... We won round down on that one, it's fine. We get the fifth round of the FA Cup and reach the first knockout rounds. We have to progress out of this European group stage. Obviously, in the league, three points would put us in the seventh. So, we, 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 we're safe. We're safe for now. Looking ahead, though, we do have some difficult games. Next month, Leicester, Tottenham, Man, Ufk, not even a real team. Everton, uh, Man, Man United, right, are shocking in real life, but chances are they're going to be absolutely outstanding in the game because that is tends to be how it works. Young boys as well, they're top of the group. They did beat Jablonek. We have a better understanding of how well they are doing after this game, fingers crossed. But without further ado... Let's have a look at the data hub, which isn't exactly helping me. It's just telling me exactly what I know and that we're disappointing everywhere. Let's look at the average. We're shocking. We're shocking. But this is what we're going with today. Ariola in goal. We have Masuaku at the left back. Ogbonna and Zuma in the middle with Fredericks on the right. We have Noble defensive mid. Rice and Crow in the middle with Fornals, Lanzini and Bowen leading the line of attack. Do I really want to give Diop a, a quick run out to be, be honest with you? Ogbonna off, Diop on. Submit team. Let's get into this. See how we can do. Fingers crossed it goes a little, little bit better. Right. I don't know any of their players. So we'll just go to the dressing room. <laughs> Hands in pockets. We fear it's for a reason, boys. Leave it. No complications at all. And here we go, underway. We're on balance mentality, the positive kind of effort a lot exposed at the back. Lanzini, Masuaku, Rice. Slow this down a little bit so we can actually see what's happening, eh? Lanzini, he looks like he's putting straight through to Bowen, who should score. Jared Bowen, second goal of the season. We're at home, this should be an easy victory, really. But I kind of ruined that, uh, that, that passage of play there, didn't I? 
to Lanzini to Masuaku. Rice. See, if we were playing like League One football, right, we'd be unreal. But unfortunately, we're not. That was a bit harsh on Jablonek then, wasn't it? Jablonek, it sounds like something out of Star Wars. Here we go, goal kick. Put it in the box. I'll put it on, I'll see how it goes. This, this game's been easy game. Anyway. Alex Kral runs in with a header. I signed Alex Kral. Well, I think it might be Marseille last year. I think. He was decent. He's Croatian or something, isn't he? If this. Is he Croatian or one of them kind of. Yeah. Czech Republic, one of them kind of nations. 23 years of age. We're doing okay, I think. We'll be fine after this. This will restore a little bit of a. Uh, little bit of pride in the job. Noble. Good delivery. Masuaku can get there. We have another opportunity to put it back in the box, though. Bonals. D up, edge of the box. It's a D up. He comes on. Scores that. 20 minutes in, 3 0. This is getting kind of. Uh, I'm buzzing I didn't play the players that weren't fit. This is one of them games where you're lucky you get this. If you're in Europe, this is the kind of team you want at least. You want two of these in your group, really. We haven't got that, unfortunately. You have two of these in your group, but you're saving a lot of, a lot of uh, lads' energy. Looks like young boys are drawing. But I can't see them. Might have already played, which means they did draw. Hmm, weird. Napoli doing the business there. Dinamo. Oh, like why do they appear for like a split second and then they disappear? We're going to... Hands on hips. We're going to say I'm pleased. We've created chances, boys. Fitness-wise, we do need to probably swap out people when they get struggling. There's a lot of people struggling at the same time. It's not what we need. It is not what we need. A lot of people struggling at the same time. Well, there's Brabeck. Rice is probably the main concern. We need to keep Rice fit. Suchek. The only option I have is Suchek. We can play a half each, can't we? We'll put Suchek on for Rice. You need to get Rice fully fit. I mean, he was obviously at the Euros on this, so he has been a little bit out of business, hasn't he? Wagner. Hoot. Benes. Redrick gets in there. Bowen. Kral. Look at this. Pa this is a nice passing round here, though. He has got his goal. He's happy. Will Rice get a goal before he comes off? No. Lovely ball, Lanzini, though. Has a go. Bit easy, isn't it, this? <laughs> It's hard to get excited when you play a team like this, to be honest with you. But you can only beat what is in front of you, is what a great man said. These are in front of me. A nice ball, to be fair, you know, for Niles. Lanzini. Getting the job done. I think... See, I don't know how it works. If I disable the first... We haven't got a transfer budget at the moment, right? But I'm wondering if I've disabled that, it'll completely wreck our chances of signing anybody. Fingers crossed it won't. If it doesn't, we're going to spend our money on a striker. Don't know how good the striker will be, but he'll be a striker. Jared Bowie on the right. Puts it in. Oh, it's going to be a penalty. Get to VAR, son. Get to the VAR. Get, on the, get to the screen. Get to the screen. He doesn't need to go to the screen. Being told through the earpiece. Penalty awarded. Be nice if we could get a decent, a decent goal here. This isn't 5 0. Top corner. Top bins. Oh, he's going to put it over. It's Mark Noble. Doesn't miss twice. It's the pressure, I think. If this was Man U, he'd missed that, hadn't he? In real life. Yes. In case you missed the whole debate about whether you've taken the penalty, the answer is yes, he should have. Funny. Right, I don't think we've got anyone else. We can... We've got two keepers on the bench because we haven't got any enough players to fill our bench. You never know when I keep my one to come up front, you know? Fredericks, Bowen, Fredericks again. I, I like Fredericks, me. Not the best game, but he's be decent at Lansley. Oh, dear me. Have we got a left back we can put on? This is all now about preserving fitness. These will be playing the next game. Take Bowen off. Oh, he's got a goal. Take Bowen off. But Yamalenko. Why has that come up? Yamalenko's on. 6-0. 65th minute. What what is happening? The keeper's buzzing. Kulebeck has let in six goals and he's bouncing around like it's Christmas Day. Oh! Young young boys are winning 3-0. Well, 
When did that happen? Young boys have been in three against Leon. So they are arguably better than us. I don't think this, but arguably you, you could argue they're better than us. Can't concede here. Yeah, I, I'm gonna keep I was gonna go defensive, but then whoa, wow, really? Which means Antonio's coming on and he's not the fittest man in the world. I really read them without that. Another man out. We'll have to check the injury, but another another injury at the team. 6-0, we'll take 6-0. Everyone's got to run out. Confidence should be high after that kind of result. You have to hope. We've got <laughs> we've got a hell of a month coming up. Got two got two look at these. Got thumping and clean sheet. I haven't got a clean sheet yet. Shocking. Absolutely shocking. I want to say it's a deal to the man that uh, made that happen. Yamalenko, four to five weeks. Four to five weeks. I, I can't. I need to get a break. Someone give me a break, please, man. Please give me a break. Young boys, we play them twice next. So obviously, one, me, you. A win and a draw will do me. But that is it for this episode. We have horrible, horrible games coming up, but we're going to come back. I think we'll come back for young boys because the Europe. This is mainly about being Europe. Obviously, I think we'll be all right in the league. We won't go. We won't go down at least. If I keep my job, I won't go down. Um, young boys will be the next episode. It's going to be it's going to be rough the next time I see you. It, it, it's just going to be rough. So there we go. A six 0 win. I mean, last time you saw us, it was a 2-0 loss. And Leeds are now in the bottom half of the table, like in the relegation zone. So, we're bouncing back. A few more games, I'm still trying to work on this formation and get it perfect. I think a few more games, we'll be more than happy to make this work. But, thank you for watching, guys. Check out the Young Boy save, in, which will be the next update. I can't talk. I'm losing my voice. I'm very ill. But, stay safe, guys, and I'll catch you next time.